So hello friends, uh, today we are doing a live demonstration of an ACL injury with a meniscus tear. The patient is a 16 year old young girl. She sustained an injury to her knee uh, in the school while playing. And if you see the sagittal sections, uh, it is quite obvious. Can you zoom in please? It is quite obvious that there is a absent meniscus sign. So you can see that the meniscus is absent in the posterior part. All, also in the body, you can see the meniscus is not seen where it should be. So you can see that there is a loss of meniscus on the posterior horn. And when we go uh, laterally, we can see a classical double PCL sign. If you can see, this is the PCL and this is a medial meniscus. So you can see that there is a double PCL sign here, which is very, very classical of a locked bucket handle tear. The ACL shadows are not well visualized. It looks like it's a Sherman grade 2 or 3 kind of a bad ACL injury. And if we see on the lateral compartment, it is okay. And this is uh, accompanied with effusion. So that is suggestive of an acute sort of an injury, which has led to. So basically an acute injury, uh, pivotal mechanism, a twisting injury to the knee, which is leading to the ACL tear as well as the locked bucket handle tear. Now if you see the uh, seizure, Coronal sections, you can appreciate that again the meniscus fragment is seen here. So you can see the meniscus fragment is here. So this is the locked bucket handle fragment which is into the notch. The There is no meniscus which is seen on this part. So the middle meniscus where it is torn, you cannot see the body of the meniscus because it is, it is a locked tear which is flipped into the notch. So you cannot see the meniscus here. Uh, you cannot, and you can see the meniscus here. So this is an anterior notch and the anterior part, you can see the meniscus here. So the meniscus is actually locked into the notch and we need to plan to reduce the meniscus by our maneuvers and then repair it. So in these kind of a young, uh, young girls like 16 year of age, acute injury, these tears must be repaired because if you just dissect this meniscus, these patients will land up into osteoarthritis very fast in their life. So it is very imperative for these patients so that you repair this meniscus. So we will be demonstrating the repair, the repair techniques of a locked bucket handle tear, how we reduce it, how we repair it. Still, uh, the inside out repair is the gold standard of repairs of these bucket handle tears. And we will be using the striker sharpshooter system to repair the bucket handle, uh, bucket handle tear, reduce it and repair it with a posterior middle safety incision. And we will be doing an ACL reconstruction with a button pro cinch on the top and a, a striker screw on the uh, tibia. So let's start with the live surgery. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. 